Hey, what's up everybody? Welcome back to the channel. In this video, I'm going to do a quick review of the Ridge wallet. And this is a longer term review. I got this wallet about three years ago. And of course, this is not a sponsored video of any sort. They didn't send this to me. I just, actually, I didn't buy it. My uncle gave this to me as a gift about three years ago. And uh, prior to that, I had just a normal wallet, like most guys do, I guess. And uh, when he gave it to me just out of the blue, I was really intrigued by the idea of having a a much more minimal wallet, not this big bulky thing with so many cards in it and all the different things, a much smaller, quicker, lighter wallet. So I tried it out and I've been using it every single day since I got it and haven't gone back to my normal wallet. So I thought I'd do a quick three year review, tell you what I think about it. This is the, I guess it's the aluminum version. It is the aluminum version. I know there's different colors and different materials. And I guess let's start off with the obvious, like how is it holding up? So I'll try to get a close up on that so you can see after three years, it definitely does show quite a, quite a bit of uh, wear and tear. You know, I don't know if it's, it's possible to see it. Yeah, there we go. But even on the edges, even especially like on some of the corners, there's actually uh, dents where the aluminum has been kind of mangled a little bit, but that doesn't really bother me. In fact, I kind of am proud of it. Kind of shows that I've been using it, you know, it's, it's give, it gives it some character. So that doesn't bother me at all, but just to let you know, you know, three years of, of regular use will show some wear, at least on the aluminum. But functionally, I haven't done anything. I haven't had to adjust these screws. I haven't had to do absolutely anything with it. It's exactly as I originally got it. Now, I chose the elastic band one. I know there's also uh, a version with a clip. And I would like to try the clip. So if Ridge, or you do happen to see this, so if you are watching, you can send me a clip one. And I'll definitely sh try it and do a, a review on that too. But I have this one, and in terms of holding money, in my opinion, it works okay. It's not great. Um, I don't really like to hold much cash in here usually. I mean, you can see it's working. It works. But sometimes if you're not careful, you're not um, intentional about how you fold up your cash, it can be hanging over the edge and a bit floppy. If you fold it up neatly like I have here, it's really nice. It's actually not bad. But in general, I don't actually like to have cash. Uh, on this wallet. Now I, I do have some here because I need to pay someone tomorrow. This is uh, $300 in 20s. I just got it at the ATM. So it's quite a bit. But just I mean watch watch as I put it in here. It's a little bit, for me anyway, it's a little bit slightly cumbersome. So I go like that and I kind of shimmy it in. Try to lift a little bit. It's not super super smooth in my opinion. Actually a normal wallet is a bit smoother with the cash in and out. And I've also used this with euros, which have some of the thicker, uh, a little bit thicker. I've used it with uh, Swiss francs. I've used it with uh, a number of different uh, currencies and uh, none of them really work that good. I think the dollar is actually the best for it. It's kind of a rather, a little bit of a shorter bill, I think. Anyway, um, not really a big fan of using the cash with it. So usually I don't use it, use it with any cash. Usually I just leave it like this, which makes a really nice neat wallet. I, I really enjoy using it in this in this way. It is nice that it has this in case I do need to put some cash in it. So I wouldn't take it off or anything like that. But um, yeah, I, I prefer not to use it with it. I mean, I do have cash in there often, but I don't really think it's a great way to hold your cash. Okay. Um, in terms of the elastic, by the way, it's still in great condition, I believe. I mean, maybe if you look close, you can see a little bit of wear, but it does pick up a little bit of these little white things, but I mean the elastic power is still like new. I think it works fine. Now the biggest thing about it that's the best, obviously, is how small it is. It's it's a uh, you know compact. It's neat, and uh, I have an unusual amount of cards in here now. I'm going to count them for you off camera. I don't want everyone to see my cards. Okay, I just counted them. I have seven cards in here right now, varying thicknesses. One of them is a metal, a metal like aluminum card. Some of them are really thin. So seven cards of various uh, thicknesses in there, and that's totally fine. I think you could go even more, maybe 10, 12, who knows, still comfortably. But seven is working just fine. Normally I only have about five. I have two of, two of them, ex two extra ones here, my, my uh, VMX licenses, which I went ahead and put on the outside. So you can kind of see the way I do it, basically the way I operate it. Um, I don't know if this is the right way or anything like that, but what I do is when I'm, when I'm at the uh, store, I pop them out and I just take them all out just like that, put this in my palm. 
and then go through, grab the, the one I need, and then use it. When I'm done, I stick it back on. Now here's the one thing that could maybe be improved. It's a little bit sometimes hard to, for me to get it open, but I mean, it's not a big deal, but it might be nice if they had a little something. And then I just go like that and I stick them all back in there. It's a, once you get the hand, hand uh, eye coordination or you know feel for it, it's really easy and smooth to do this like that. Actually, I kind of feel like uh, some kind of mag magic card guy. I'm, I'm pretty quick with it now after using it so many times. And I kind of like it. And uh, yeah, it looks cool. It looks cool when you're using it. It looks cool when you have it out. And so it's just a cool wallet and it's very convenient. I love how small it is in my pocket. It's not like a big thing that, you know, when you lean over, you don't feel it. I mean, you barely feel it in there at all, really. Uh, when you don't, when you don't have cash and you just have a handful of cards, it just feels very light. So, yeah, I don't know what else to say about it. The only thing I guess I would improve maybe is uh, if there was some way to to maybe make a notch for your thumb, just to give you a little bit of a grip, or I don't know, maybe even a slight one millimeter raised part or something, just something to get a little grip when you want to open it up. Obviously, this here is intended to to get them out. And I think I seen maybe on an advertisement somewhere where people kind of did something like that, fanned them and then grabbed their card. But for me, I find it easier just to take it out, grab it like that, use it, and then put them all back in together. Plus when you do that and you have them all out and you use one, you know you're not gonna forget to put it, to take it and put it back in uh, because it's, you know the rest of them are still in your hand. There is actually one more thing I would ask that uh, Ridge could do, and maybe I could even modify it myself is actually make this useful for makers because we could what could be nice is if you had a measurement scale here maybe in millimeters or metric or both and uh excuse me metric or and or standard or both and uh, along this scale maybe this one and maybe make this in this a more um set distance i, I think it's um uh, not really sure let's see what we have we have about six 60 millimeters um, on the height, but I think the, the or hike the shorter way, this one seems to be kind of like a 90 or 95. Uh, it would be nice if, if they could set it. I, I haven't measured it with some caliper, so I don't know. Maybe it is already, but it would be nice if it was like a, def a, a very specific defined uh, dimensions. Then it could be used by us people like to make things to measure things on the fly. If we don't have a tattoo like me, if you don't have a... Uh, calipers with you could use it as a, a ruler so um, some a scale written here or here or both um, I think would be really cool so that's about it for my three-year Ridge wallet review um, I will make another video in three more years if I'm still using this particular one but uh, if you have any comments or questions or anything like that do feel free to uh, leave them down below thanks for watching bye